Number 1. French Quarter. The French Quarter of New Orleans is what most tourists come to see when they visit the city. Set along a bend on the Mississippi River, the main attraction here is the architecture, but it is also a great area for dining and entertainment. Number 2. Mardi Gras. Mardi Gras is New Orleans' signature event, with celebrations that span a two-week period, ending with the finale on Shrove Tuesday, the day before Ash Wednesday. Bourbon Street is one of the main areas where people congregate. Number 3. National World War II Museum. The National World War II Museum is an outstanding museum, with engaging exhibits and documentary snippets that tell the history of World War II as it was fought in Europe and in the Pacific. Number 4. Jackson Square. Jackson Square is the main square in the heart of the French Quarter, originally known as Place d'Armes. In the center of the square, surrounded by trees and greenery, is an equestrian statue, 1856, of General Andrew Jackson. Number 5. Preservation Hall. Preservation Hall is an unassuming old building that has long been an institution in New Orleans known for jazz music. The historic hall still features traditional jazz by local artists. Number 6. St. Louis Cathedral. On the north side of Jackson Square is the St. Louis Cathedral, a landmark structure in New Orleans. It was built in 1794 on the site of two earlier churches and is known for being the United States' oldest cathedral in continuous use. Number 7. City Park. New Orleans City Park covers more than 1,300 acres and contains numerous attractions and things to do, including the New Orleans Botanical Garden and the New Orleans Museum of Art and Sculpture Garden. Number 8. Louisiana State Museum at the Cabildo. The Cabildo, to the left of St. Louis Cathedral, was built in 1795 as the residence of the Spanish governor. It is noteworthy both as a historic building and for the museum and its outstanding collection. Number 9. Garden District. The Garden District is a prosperous residential area with lovely mansions, mature trees, and lush gardens, and is probably, in some respects, the stereotypical image many foreigners have of the Deep South. Number 10. Audubon Park and Audubon Zoo. Southwest of the Garden District in Uptown New Orleans is Audubon Park, established on the grounds of what had been the site of the world's industrial and cotton centennial exposition of 1884. Hope you like this video. For more videos, please subscribe to our channel.